McGee is a former defensive lineman for the University of Iowa. Well, I bet offensive lines across America let out a big sigh of relief when Big E chose the ring over a career on the gridiron. They're struggling for control right now. Oh, uh, struggle is right, Cole. This is really back and forth. Kevin Owens, let's get your take on him. Just by looking at Kevin Owens, I wouldn't think he'd be the type of superstar to pull off a moonsault. Then I saw him do it, and wow, was I ever amazed. You're talking about someone who has all the talent necessary to become one of the all-time greats. And they haven't done it yet, check out WWE.com, you'll find updates and blogs from all your favorite superstars. Yeah, and don't forget to check us out on Twitter. It's at Jerry Lawler and at Michael Cole. Right, Michael Cole? Yeah, that's original. One. Two. He's got him up high in the air. Three. It's not the only move Kevin Owens will surprise you with. He's also been known to execute a flawless senton bomb from time to time. Yeah, and guys like Kevin Owens aren't usually the ones you see doing a senton bomb. That's typically reserved for the smaller guys. Five! Six! He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Well, I don't blame him. Keep the action inside the ring. That's where you're going to win this thing. He's in big trouble. Ow! Ooh, I'm not Ooh. sure I can watch this. This is a level of destruction no one was expecting. No kidding, this is getting ugly. Oh, once you get out of the ring, anything can happen. You've got exposed steel, concrete, the barricades, and all of it can be used to cause massive oh. damage. Look out. You can't have a conversation about the finishing moves of WWE superstars and not discuss the aptly named Big Ending from Big E. You're talking about being hoisted in the air by a former professional powerlifter and driven face first into the canvas. It's literally bone shattering. Makes the cup. The range of emotions here is starting. There's almost an unknowing of what to expect. I know. I, I mean, I got goosebumps. This match is going to be so unpredictable. I just can't wait. Let me tell you something, Cole. One of the most intimidating finishing moves I have ever seen as a wrestler or as an announcer is Big E's big ending. I think part of what makes the maneuver so scary for opponents is that Big E can lift anyone up, no matter how big they are, and plant them right in the mat. Covers. Man, Kevin Owens, what offense. Looking good so far. Not much damage, if any, has been absorbed. Jerry, a WWE superstar knows their finishing move is tops on the do not experience list when fans and superstars watching the match all gasp for air after the maneuver has been executed. For Big E, that's happened every time he's dropped in another opponent with the big ending. Well, you know, Ric Flair himself has always said there's nothing like the respect of your peers. Well, there's nothing like the fear of your peers either. And that's exactly what the big ending from the powerhouse Big E has earned him. The big ending is without a doubt one of the most merciless finishing moves in all of WWE. The shoulders are down. Just making his presence felt there. Lamar 
vantage point. It doesn't even look like a sweat has been broken. Biggie's in that six feet tall, 290 pound range, and is just a monster. I mean, Biggie's power and speed is a lethal combination that I don't know if we've ever seen the likes of before. You know what that means? It means fans know that when Biggie is making his way to the ring, things are bound to get nasty in there. I mean, real nasty. The shoulders are down. Folks, if you want to learn about Raw's most tumultuous period, be sure to check out the Monday Night War on WWE Network. Now that's how you slam an opponent down with authority. You can bet he felt that. Oh, Big E's power and speed is incredible. He was a top NCAA football player at the University of Iowa and a power lifter. The fire punch Big E blast with the running body block. Good luck surviving that one. That's like being hit by a Mack truck. Two, three, what a win! Man, he's